Hello and welcome you all. I am Miss Celeste and today we are going to learn how to find out the degree of carbon and hydrogen. So all of you who are watching my video do watch it till the end. So now coming to the topic. First of all, when you say the word degree, degree of carbon and hydrogen. So degree has been classified as primary, secondary, tertiary and quaternary. First of all, let's learn degree of carbon atom. So degree of carbon is equal to the number of carbon which is attached directly to it. That means whenever a compound is given and you need to find out the degree of any carbon atom, you only need to check out that how many carbon atom is it directly attached to. Okay, so degree of carbon atom is classified as primary or you can say 1 degree, secondary or 2 degree, tertiary or 3 degree and quaternary or 4 degree. Here I have taken a structure in which the central carbon atom for which you need to find out the degree. So first of all the central carbon atom is attached to one other carbon atom. Okay. So that means here you can say that the central carbon atom which is blue in color it is showing one degree or it is a primary carbon atom. Okay. So primary carbon atom is directly attached to one other carbon atom. Okay. For this structure, the central carbon atom is attached to two other carbon atoms. Okay. That means you can say that this central carbon atom which is blue in color that is showing secondary or two degree. Okay. So secondary carbon atom means it is directly attached to two other carbon atoms. For this structure, there are three carbon atoms which are attached to the central carbon atom. Okay. So, you can say that this central carbon atom is showing 3 degree or it is a tertiary carbon because it is attached to three other carbon atoms. So, tertiary carbon atom means it is attached to three other carbon atoms. And this one here, the central carbon atom is showing quaternary. Okay, that is 4 degree because there are 4 carbon atoms which are directly attached to the central carbon atom. So, this will, the central carbon atom will be showing quaternary. Here I have taken few examples to make you explain how to find out the degree of carbon atom. So, coming to the first structure to the left, we need to find out the degree of the carbon for the central carbon atom. Okay. So now here the central carbon atom is attached to one CH3 group. That means it is attached to one carbon atom. That means the central carbon is showing one degree carbon. For this second structure, there are two CH3 groups attached to the central carbon atom. Okay. So this central or the middle carbon atom is showing two degree carbon. For this third structure, you can say that there are three CH3 groups which are directly attached to this one central carbon atom. So this central carbon atom will be showing three degree or tertiary carbon. And for this fourth structure, there are four CH3 groups attached. So that means you can say there are four carbon atoms attached to the middle carbon atom. So this middle carbon atom will be showing four degree carbon. Here I have taken an example of propane molecule in which you can see propane there are three carbon atoms okay and you need to find out the degree of carbon for each of these carbon atoms. Now starting with the first carbon atom to the left this carbon is attached to one nearby carbon atom that means you can say that this carbon is showing one degree. For the second carbon it is attached to two other carbon atom, one carbon to the left and one carbon to the right. That means you can say that the central one is showing two degree carbon. While coming to the third one, here this carbon is attached to one carbon atom to the left. That means you can say that this carbon atom is showing one degree. 
Now we shall see how to find out the degree of hydrogen atom. So degree of hydrogen is same as that of the carbon to which it is attached. Okay. So whatever is the degree of the carbon atom will be the same for the hydrogen atom to which it is attached. Okay. So degree of hydrogen it is classified as primary or 1 degree, secondary or 2 degree, tertiary or 3 degree. And there is no such thing as quaternary hydrogen. But when you saw in the case of carbon, there was a thing called quaternary carbon. Okay. But here, in this case, for the hydrogen atom, there is no quaternary hydrogen. Here in this example, you need to find out the degree for the circled hydrogen atom. Okay. For that, first of all, you need to find out the degree of the carbon to which it is attached. So the carbon atom here is directly attached to one other carbon atom. That means you can say that this carbon is having one degree or primary. It is, it is showing primary carbon. So the hydrogen to which it is attached will be all also showing the primary hydrogen or one degree. For the second structure here, here again you need to find out the degree for this circled hydrogen. So for that you need to check the degree of the carbon atom to which it is attached. Now this carbon is attached to two other carbon atoms. That means this carbon is showing a secondary carbon. So the hydrogen atom will be also showing a secondary or two degree hydrogen. Similar is the case with this third structure. Again whatever is the degree of the carbon atom will be the same for the hydrogen atom. So the carbon, the central carbon is showing a tertiary 3 degree structure. So the hydrogen attached to it will be also a tertiary hydrogen. In both these examples, you can see, first of all, in the first structure for this circled hydrogen atom, this is showing 3 degree because the carbon to which it is attached is again attached to three other carbon atoms. That means this carbon atom, the central carbon atom is showing three degree structure. That means the hydrogen to which it is attached is also having a tertiary hydrogen. Okay. Now for the rest of the hydrogens, they are showing one degree because the hydrogen to which the car, the carbon to which it is attached, this carbon is again attached to one carbon atom. Okay. That means you can say that if the carbon is showing 1 degree, so the hydrogen will be also having primary 1 degree structure. For the second structure, uh, first of all check the degree of the carbon atom. For this carbon atom, it is attached to one other carbon atom. Okay, So the carbon will be showing 1 degree. So the hydrogen to which it is attached, the hydrogen will be also showing 1 degree or primary. Okay, so all the hydrogens which is attached to the carbon, they are showing one degree or primary structure. So this was all about the degree of carbon and hydrogen. I hope this is clear to you all. So now we shall meet in the next class with a new topic. So till then take care and don't forget to hit the like button and do subscribe my channel. Thank you.